Hello. Hi. Hey. Oh, hey. you look so good. Thank you. Oh my God, it's been too long. Are we yeah. rolling? Hi guys. Um, do we need the spotlight? <laughs> We are live on Periscope, actually. Oh, cool. Yes, and this is recording. Sweet. Hello, everybody. Isn't she fierce? <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> now, Rika, we have to talk about your costume and staging. This is so out there and so original. What are you going for? Oh, well, I started working with Lynn Blondre for the national final. And yeah, we, we kind of had a collaboration. They designed it and they made it. But I felt like really um, involved in the whole process. What's it called, Lynn Lingerie? Lynn Lingerie, they're in Zurich. Okay, so it's like a, a Swiss lingerie company. Yeah. They have the perfect muse in you. I am <laughs> loving this. Thank you. <laughs> and the mood, I guess, how does it reflect the mood of your song? Uh, yeah, I feel like we, we really wanted to have a lot of wind on stage, so the, <laughs> the skirt had to be like really light. And also I like to work with um, uh, like I don't know, like a lot of plastics and stuff ah. and like recycled stuff. So it kind of looks, I feel like it has like a kind of plasticky okay. thing. Yeah. Also, I like the shapes that they, that they use in their, in their bodysuits and their bras and stuff. And mm. so we have like the cutout, the cutout here. I really like that. And I really feel like it's really me. Yeah. So. And <laughs> your dancing, I love your dancing because so many other people have very structured performances, like choreographed, like robots, whereas you seem to just be doing your thing. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's really, I mean, it's important for me to feel good and move around and stuff. And I mean, for my live show, normally I have a trampoline on stage oh, now. Wow. So I, I feel like I, I like to express <laughs> myself through movement. And it's really important to me to be be free like that. How lucky your partner is. Now, to answer me this, the trampoline, what do you do with that on stage? I jump on it. Like, while you sing? <laughs> yeah. Isn't that, like, really hard? <laughs> yeah, it's hard. <laughs> Canadians have many skills, clearly. Mm -hmm, yes. And what about the LED wall? You've got a waterfall. Yeah. Yeah. You're I mean, loving it. I, I, it's it's so nice and it's so funny because the first time the first rehearsal with the with the like fires mm. the fire shower thing it's so funny because I was just so in the moment that I I didn't like I knew I knew it was gonna be there but I didn't even like realize it at the time mm. and then when we watched it after I was like Jesus there was a fire behind me so cool. <laughs> <laughs> and the thing our readers keep commenting on, um, the first rehearsal you had blue curly hair. Yeah. And say you've got blue straight hair. Yeah. I guess, wh what are you, go you've changed it up, why? Yeah, I don't know, we, we wanted to use the rehearsal as a, as a, you know, a time to play while mm. we can, so. And which one will you go with? Oh, it's a secret. Oh. Oh. I like both of them. This is very elegant and chic. The other one is crazy, but I yeah. like that. Yeah. Okay. And are you naturally curly or straight? Naturally curly. Okay. But not uh, not with my not with blonde. <laughs> uh, <laughs> blue is not your natural color. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's very dirty pop though. It's like it kind of fits your brand. Yeah. 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 Absolutely. Now you've been all over Europe, Amsterdam, Tel Aviv, yeah. London. Like, w what was the most memorable experience on the tour? Uh, I think uh, my favorite was Amsterdam, mm -hmm. I think, and but really it was just nice to, to be with everybody and to meet mm -hmm. them and to to like have this adventure with everybody and yeah, no, no, because I really love everybody. Oh, oh, Miss <laughs> Switzerland, Miss Universe. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's been so nice just getting to know everyone and like um, especially like Hovi and Zoe oh. and, and really and uh, yeah, oh, and I love nice. all the songs. I sing them. They're always in my head. It's on like rotation, getting stuck in my head. So. How many times have you sung "The Last of Our Kind" at this point? Probably uh, like infinity. <laughs> 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 and in like every interview, infinity. I bet. Infinity. <laughs> yeah. Amazing. Now we love "The Last of Our Kind," but we want to hear you sing movies. Could you hear a little, sing a little bit sure. of that? Sure. Uh oh. <laughs> I'm an electric fence, hardwired to keep you out. But your shit is so intense, I'll let you in, no doubt. It's like a hurricane, so unpredictable. I love the way you sin, my kind of trouble. Truth is what we want it to be. No one knows the words that we've said. We fight. 
We fight. Kiss me, I'd be behind the smoke screen. Let's make love like in the movies. Burn bright. Burn bright. Ah, oh, you don't sing. You make love, honey. That was amazing. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Now, Rika, final question for you because there's a line of people who want to talk to you. <laughs> What do you consider success at Eurovision? Success for me, I think, I think it might be possible for me to feel really, really comfortable. Maybe not even so crazy nervous. Mm. And I, that's what I really want. I want to feel really good on stage, and I want to sing the best that I can. Oh, here we are at the end of the movie. Never felt so alive. <laughs> Love you, baby. Thank I you. Love you. Mwah. Mwah.